Ever wondered what happens when AI becomes smarter than us? As we approach AGI, ASI, and the end AI stage singularity, the line between innovation and danger is getting thinner. Are we prepared for a world where machines think, evolve, and control their own future? When the war started, they protected me. Took better care of me than humans would have. They're not people, Maya. It's just programming. AGI in 2025 to 2029. Right now, we're in the age of AI, a time where breakthroughs like ChatGPT and self-driving cars are reshaping our world. But right now, everyone, from Sam Altman to some of the brightest minds in tech, is aiming for one big goal, AGI, or Artificial General Intelligence. Now think of it like this. Today's AI systems are like super smart calculators. They can solve problems and make decisions, but only within a limited scope. However, AGI will be more like a human mind. It will learn, reason, and adapt to any task, no matter how complex or unfamiliar. It's a type of intelligence that doesn't just follow pre-programmed instructions, but evolves and improves as it interacts with the world, much like how humans learn from their mistakes. Once we achieve artificial general intelligence, the possibilities are endless. AGI could help solve some of humanity's biggest challenges, like curing diseases, tackling climate change, or even exploring the farthest reaches of space. But with this immense power comes great responsibility. And in this complex world, do you think we'd be able to use it responsibly? How can we ensure that AGI is used for the greater good and not for harm? These are questions that need to be answered as we move closer to this next milestone in AI development. Well, there's been a lot of speculation lately that AGI might already exist, but isn't being shared publicly yet. Some people believe that companies like OpenAI, the creators of ChatGPT, have reached milestones in AGI development but are keeping the details under wraps for now. Interestingly, a few former employees from these tech giants have suggested something similar, hinting that the technology might be further along than most of us realize. For three years, I worked as a member of technical staff at OpenAI. Companies like OpenAI are working towards building artificial general intelligence, AGI. They are raising billions of dollars towards this goal. OpenAI's charter defines AGI as highly autonomous systems that outperform humans at most economically valuable work. That this means AI systems that could act on their own over long periods of time and do most jobs that humans can do. AI companies are making rapid progress towards building AGI. A few days before this hearing, OpenAI announced a new system, GPT-01, that passed significant milestones, including one that was personally significant for me. When I was in high school, I spent years training for a prestigious international computer science competition. OpenAI's new system leaps from failing to qualify to winning a gold medal doing better than me in an area relevant to my own job. There are still significant gaps to close, but I believe it is plausible that an AGI system could be built in as little as three years. AGI would cause significant changes to society, including radical changes to the economy and employment. AGI could also cause catastrophic harm via systems autonomously conducting cyber attacks or assisting in the creation of novel biological weapons. OpenAI's new AI system is the first system to show steps towards biological weapons risk, as it is capable of helping experts in planning to reproduce a known biological threat. Without rigorous testing, developers might miss this kind of dangerous capability. While OpenAI has pioneered aspects of this testing, they've also repeatedly prioritized speed of deployment over rigor. This brings up some important questions. Why keep something as significant as AGI a secret? If you're interested in exploring this topic further, I cover it in detail in a video where I discuss what former employees have shared about AGI. You can check it out by clicking the I button to dive into the full discussion. ASI in 2035. 
Now, after achieving AGI possibly as early as 2025 or 2026, we'll be moving toward the next big milestone, ASI. ASI stands for Artificial Superintelligence. Now, while AGI represents a machine that thinks and learns at a human level, ASI would go far beyond that, reaching levels of intelligence that surpass even the smartest human minds in every field. From science to art to social understanding, ASI can also innovate things in ways that might be difficult for us to even imagine. It would be capable of processing and learning information at speeds and depths unimaginable to humans, advancing technology, medicine, and potentially every other field at a pace that's hard to picture. Once we have ASI, it could unlock answers to some of the biggest mysteries in the universe. We might finally understand what lies beyond the infinite universe, or even discover what's really inside a black hole. ASI could explore the questions that have puzzled humanity for ages, giving us insights that could completely change how we see the universe and our place in it. Nick Bostrom, a renowned philosopher and AI expert, has warned that ASI could be the last invention humanity ever needs to make, pointing out both its immense potential and terrifying existential risks. But why would he say something so unsettling? Because once ASI is created, it could create itself an even more advanced version, starting an endless cycle of self-improvement that humans can't stop or control. It would be an intelligence so far beyond us that we wouldn't even be able to comprehend its goals or actions. Have you watched the movie Ex Machina? It's a chilling exploration of artificial intelligence that feels eerily similar to the concept of ASI. In the film, a highly advanced AI begins to surpass its creator's control, leading to unforeseen consequences. After ASI, we may be heading toward what's known as the Singularity. Singularity in 2045 the concept of AI singularity suggests that there may come a time in the future when artificial intelligence evolves so far beyond our understanding that we simply can't keep up. Imagine trying to comprehend the depths of a black hole. Scientists have spent years studying it, yet every time they try to measure how deep it really is, the answer comes back as infinite. Similarly, how high the sky goes is a mystery we can't truly pinpoint. The limits just don't seem to exist. When it comes to the singularity, we don't know exactly what the world will look like, but there are plenty of predictions and theories about the challenges humanity could face. Some science fiction movies have offered a glimpse into what could happen when technology becomes so advanced that we lose control, depicting a future where AI evolves beyond human comprehension. These stories often show the darker side of technological advancement, where AI becomes so powerful it could pose a serious threat to our existence. It's unsettling, yet it serves as a stark reminder that the path we're on with AI may hold both incredible breakthroughs and potential dangers. Famous futurist Ray Kurzweil, in his book Singularity is Near, predicts that by 2045, computers will be smarter than humans, a moment he calls the singularity. By the time we get to 2045, we'll be able to multiply our intelligence many millions fold. And it's just very hard to imagine what that will be like. And that's the singularity where we can't even imagine. Right, that's why we call it the singularity. It's a singularity in physics. Something gets sucked into its singularity and you can't tell what's going on in there because no information can get out of it. There's various problems with that, but that's the idea. It, it's, too, uh, it's too much beyond what we can imagine. This isn't just speculation. It's based on his in-depth study of how technology has evolved over time. He refers to this phenomenon as the law of accelerating returns, which suggests that every year, technology doesn't just improve. It improves faster than the year before. Essentially, Kurzweil argues that the pace of innovation is snowballing, and as we approach the singularity, 
technological advancements will reach a point where machines surpass human intelligence in ways we can't fully grasp yet. If you want to know more about Singularity, watch this video on your screen.